Hello Zebraherd, welcome to Paper Mario the Origami King, a brand new Paper Mario adventure now on the Nintendo Switch. You might know a few years ago we played the previous Paper Mario game, Paper Mario Color Splash on the Wii U, and I had so much fun. That was one of my favorite Wii U games. It was one of our most popular series. You guys just really, really enjoyed it. And I've also been playing through Paper Mario on the Nintendo 64 to prepare for this game. We just finished that one, and I had a blast with both of those games, so I'm so excited for this one. We'll see how it goes. I think we're gonna have a lot of fun. We'll be playing through the entire game I'll be trying to complete it 100% seems like it has an awesome story and yeah let's see how this adventure unfolds <laughs> okay enough with the silly jokes let's get started with Paper Mario the Origami King what's going on Oh, it's Mario and Luigi still riding on uh, Luigi's go-kart. Isn't this great, bro? Back on the road again together and heading to some kind of festival. What did the invitation say again? An origami festival? What's that gonna be like? And I can't wait to say hello to Princess Peach. It's been a while. So is this playing like right after Color Splash? I mean, I guess not right after. You said it's been a while, but the Luigi's cart was in Color Splash towards the end of it. So maybe? Interesting. Wow, so here we go. Wow, it looks so cool. So there's origami everywhere. Everything's all folded and stuff. <laughs> Where is everybody? Here we are, Toad Town, and there's Peach's Castle. It's a ghost town, though. Everybody left their food out and everything. Huh, where is everybody? You don't think we missed it, do you? Mario, check the invitation again. When were we supposed to be here? You are invited to an origami festival in fabulous Toad Town. Date, Z circle, circle, XX, Peach. The, the dating system in Mario World is weird. Uh, well, it's the right day. You think they're still getting things ready? Let's go check the castle. Maybe everyone's inside. Hmm, all right. I love how they share the same cart though. That's such like a little brotherly thing to do, it's cute. Something's weird going on here. I don't know what it is, but. Oh, now things are getting a little messier. I don't like the looks of this. Anybody home? Well, her castle looks fine. It's ominous music, but it actually looks totally fine. So, what's up with that? I don't know what's going on. This is weird. Here we are, Peach's castle. I'm gonna park the cart, okay? I don't wanna tip the bell. <laughs> All right, <laughs> see you, Luigi. <laughs> All right, well, I guess we're on our own for right now. Wow. Well, like I said, everything seems fine. Hey, Luigi. Sorry for the wait, bro. Let's go see the princess. And we have 50 HP, cool. <laughs> Can I talk to Luigi? Uh, th okay, there's a couple buttons I could press here, but none of it matters too much. I guess we're just supposed to go into the castle. Sure. Wow. It's as pretty as usual in here. It's kind of spooky in here, isn't it? And where is everybody? I'd expect to at least see one toad by now. Maybe they all had to go to the bathroom at the same exact time. Mamma mia, I forgot our gift in the cart. I'll just dash over and get it. <laughs> Ooh, she's so forgetful. Oh, oh no! Okay, I don't like that. How am I gonna get outside when the door's locked? Don't worry, Mario. I know just what to do in situations like this. You just gotta find Mario. Right, Mario? Oh. We're saved! Okay, I'm just gonna take a deep breath and go find the key to this door. That's what you, you do, right? 
Tell Princess Peach I'll be right there if you see her first, okay? Bye-bye. <laughs> All right, well, I mean, you could have just stuck with us, but yeah, sure, why not? Right now, we'll just go this way. So he ran off ahead. We're sort of on our own again. Wow, I guess this is like the main foyer. Mario, is that you? Princess? Uh, Princess, you're not looking okay. Did you do something different with your hair? How good to see you. Answer me this. Shouldn't the Mushroom Kingdom unfold and be refolded unto glory? Um, I think it's fine how it is. And what of those toads? Shouldn't they be silenced for all of eternity? No, of course not. I see. Last question. Will you see or crease yourself and be reborn like me? You know, I've answered no all the other times. Let's go, let's go three for three. Wrong answer. Right answer, it matters not. Your replies are all paper thin. Goodbye. What? No, oh, no! Mario! What is going on? What happened to Princess Peach? She's origami now. Mario? Wait, these are all Bowser's bad guys. I guess, yeah, they're in the dungeon. Oh, he's gotta make a flashy entrance, huh? Are you here for the origami festival too? This dungeon-themed waiting lounge is a huge upgrade from the last festival I attended. Very classy. You ain't seen Master Bowser anywhere, have you? I ain't like the big lug to leave us minions hanging out of a public place. Whoa, Mario, you're here? I'm a big fan, or I, I mean, I've always wanted to battle you. Even if I get stomped, it would be an honor. Wow, this is all so exciting. First, you see Princess Peach, and now you. Huh. Something weird is going on. I gotta say, the princess was a little different than I expected, less lifelike. Maybe that wasn't the princess. Uh-oh, what's going on with these guys? Come with us. Yeah, what's next? I've never seen a toad before. Please tell me it's a toad. This is a shy guy. You should know that. Not you. Aw, oh, hope you don't have to wait too long, Mario. I'll say hi to toad for you. Uh-oh. What in the world is going on? Mario, is that you? I need your help. I'm, I'm, I'm in a very strange place. It's cramped and dark, almost like I'm between dimensions or something. Is this Princess Peach talking to us? I'm not sure if I could be amazed or scared, but I'm kind of both. If it's not too much trouble, I'd like to get out now, please. Is there any way you can help? Uh, what's this? What's that? Did something light up at your feet? Is it a magic circle? Yeah, it looks like a hand. That's good, I think. I mean, I'm not really sure what you're supposed to do with, with it. Can you try to use it somehow? Um, X to 1,000 fold arms. What? What is that supposed to mean? Whoa, okay. I guess Mario's joining the arms roster now. That that sounded good. Are your arms all big and foldy now? I've heard about this. I think those are called a thousand fold arms. Try feeling around a bit. Maybe you can help me escape from this strange dimension. If it feels like the arms are off center and out of control, maybe try pressing R to reset them. What in the world? Wow, well, it's like motion controls. A little to the left. Oh, a little higher. Just a little higher. Oh, do you need to start over? Maybe try, no, 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 I got it, I got it. And then am I supposed to? I don't know exactly what I'm looking for. Oh, 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 there we go, yes, you're right there. Grab. Whoa! Who are you? Oh, hi. 
Wow, I'm free from that weird in-between dimension. Oh, was I just stuck in that wall? You must be Maria. My name's Olivia. You'd probably like to know a lot more about me and why I was trapped like that, huh? Of course. But I don't think we really have the time for that now. Maybe we should just get out of here. There's just one thing. I'm not exactly fleet of foot. Mind if I hitch a ride? Sure. I don't mind helping. Oh, she really just folds up really tiny. That's cute. So yeah, what exactly are we gonna do around here? Whoa, hey! What do you look at that? You got it! Hammer. All right, so Mario's classic hammer makes a return. Whoa, what'd you find? It looks big and smashy. Maybe try pressing B and see what happens. Sure. So as you can see, we can break some boxes, but not too big of boxes. If they're flimsy, it looks like we can get through. So I wonder, is there anything else we can hit with the hammer? Maybe back over this way, we can open it maybe? Nope, it's definitely locked. Okay, so I guess we're just going to this hole in the, in the right. You know, I feel I just had a pretty good idea. I don't know if they'll always be good ideas, but I'm happy to share them with you. Why don't you try pressing X if you're stuck, and I'll see if I can think of something useful. Who knows, maybe we'll get get to know each other and make a great team. Is that how things go? I, I guess so. Oh, thank you for calling on me with X. It's my first hint. Now for an actual hint. Um, That hole in the wall looks like it might be a way to sneak out. I guess so. I don't know if I'll call on her every time. I don't know if it's really like a Goombario situation where she'll have something interesting to say for each area. Hmm. Okay, I'm getting my bearings. I think we might be in the castle dungeon. Dungeons smell like this place smells, right? I guess so. I'm feeling like a good hurry is in order. Is there a way out of here nearby? See, she doesn't really describe the area as much as she tries to tell you what to do next. So I don't know if that's necessary for me to do all the time. Hey, knock it off! Was that Bowser? It sounded like it. Ow! What is going on? Bowser's all folded up! I can see what you're about to do to my minion and I order you to cut it out! He is not happy. No! Poor little Koopa! Leave him alone, what did he do? Oh my gosh. Oh no! Oh my gosh, did he did he get stapled? Oh my goodness, he's a folding monster now. And Bows is not happy one bit. What did you see? Nothing terrifying, I hope. That was certainly terrifying. That was the last of them. Oh gosh, we better hide. So now they're all folded up. Except for the mustachioed one. Oh, now they're gonna figure out we're gone soon. Okay, maybe I have time to explain one little thing. Those stiff looking guys are called folded soldiers. I don't want to alarm you, but they're unbelievably dangerous. I think we should try to avoid them. What do you think they meant by that was the last of them anyway? The last of what? How's Bowser doing? Oh, he's so sad. My minions, you monsters, I won't forget this. I'm gonna unfold my body and fold yours into pretzels. Poor Bowser, I actually feel bad for the guy. That's not common. Anyways, anything up here? I guess not. So we're just getting like a couple of coins here and there, but that seems well worth it. So can we go into here now? Aha, we can. All right, Bowser, I know you don't usually like seeing Mario, but I, I think we could help you out. Mario, you're here too? Well, what are you waiting for? Get me down from this thing. Even you know this is no way to treat royalty. Royalty? Ooh, nice to meet you. Is everyone in your kingdom also a face? I've got a body too. These folded jerks just bent it in ways that I won't describe in details right now. It's seen worse, believe me. Never mind that. I'm the great King Bowser and I demand to be set free and unfolded. Now, Mario, ignore your floating friend and get me down from here. Bowser commands you. I would do the same for you. <laughs> no, he would not. You need as much of me as much, you need me as much as I need you, admit it. Plus, I can tell you a secret after you free me. No one can resist a good secret. <laughs> All right, sure, why not? What do we have to lose? No, it's like pulling a bandage off halfway. Okay, I didn't do it all the way. There we go, ow, ow, ow. 
<laughs> He's just flying away now. You all right, Bowser buddy? Oh, kind of thought I'd just unfold or something. Bah, no matter. Now, as, as for that secret I promised to tell you, there's a hidden exit in this room. I heard those jerks talking about it. Lousy, no goods, body folding jerks. Now hurry up and find it, and I'll let you and I'll let you bring me along when you escape. Okay, hold on. Before we do that, he said there's a secret exit. Do you think that means it's hidden by something? Probably. But I do also want to see what was to the left. Before we do anything else, I think it's just the exit. But I should make sure if we could get extra coins or anything. Oh yeah, that's the room we were in. Where is the mustache? I can hear the folded soldiers talking. I think they might be nearby. So they're probably in that room. I don't know if we want to mess with that, so we're just gonna keep moving forward. Okay, so let's go ahead and break all of these. And look at this, we got another one of these fancy folded arm things. Weird. 1,000 fold arms, here we go! So we're just looking around for more vibrations. Right now, I'm not feeling anything. Oh, oh, here we go, here we go. Nice, that was that was weird, but I'm getting used to it. See, <laughs> where would you be without me? You're really getting the hang of those 1,000 fold arms, Mario. I guess so, so let's go up the stairs. Hopefully we can get out of here in one piece, even if that piece is very folded. And we can save. <laughs> Mario's all squished. <laughs> save complete. Save complete, huh? Guess that means that your adventure up to this point has been saved, phew. Let's make a habit of saving every time we see another one of these shiny blocks, okay? Will do. Oh, and you'll find all sorts of helpful stuff if you open the menu with plus. If you wanna try out some other options or need some help, check the gear section of the menu. Sure, so as you can see, um, we have items, accessories, weapons, the map, oh, I wanna see the map. Oh, we can't see it yet. Okay, there's a lot of things here that we just cannot see. That's okay. Um. Interesting, for sure. Let's keep it moving. And what do we got this way? Uh, not too much right now. I'm looking around for potential secrets. Maybe I shouldn't expect too much because, you know, it's the tutorial area. They can see a Bowser. He's having a hard time keeping up. There he goes. Hey, slow down. I love how he just interjects. I'm walking with my face here. Nobody makes Bowser walk with something. I mean, obviously they did. But they're not getting away with it. Woo! <laughs> I love this. I love Bowser being one of our friends in the journey so far. So what's going on up here? So this is like the door for Princess Peach. I'd imagine. Oh no, she's back. So is this really Princess Peach? She can't see me like this. Why are you still so flat? Why haven't you joined me in folded glory? Come, we can reshape you. Patience, princess, this will do just fine. So you're Mario, Princess Peach's hero, right? Yes, you'll do quite well. Very crisp. Bright colors, I can see it now. So what do you say? Hey, hey, I'm crisp. <laughs> so what do you say? Will you volunteer your paper body to the cause? Or will you, we have to get crumply. Join us, yes or no? I don't like the, the, how they've been treating people, so I'm gonna say no. Ah, I expected nothing less. And to be honest, I wouldn't have it any other way. Take a good long look at Princess Peach. She's better this way, don't you think? I don't know, she doesn't seem happier. No need to answer. You'll soon feel the power of origami for yourself. Folded soldier, come forth. Oh no. Whoa, no, it's the Goomba. He's all folded up. I've never seen a folded soldier like that, Mario. Does it look like one of your flat paper friends? Yes, it does. I never got to see Toad. <laughs> oh no, poor guy. He's walking so slowly. Prepare to be folded. Wave battle, what is this? So this is our first battle in the game. Whoa, look at this. I don't know how the battle system works in this game. I have tried to avoid spoilers as much as I could. Uh, oh no, I'm guessing this is your first time facing folded soldiers, Mario. Once these flat paper folks have been turned into folded soldiers, we can't turn them back. It seems cruel to fight them, but if we don't, they'll try to fold you into origami too. Does that mean that Princess Peach and Bowser can't be turned back? Uh-oh. 
There has to be a way. I'd help you attack, but my tiny arms don't pack much of a punch. I don't want to get in your way. So I'll cheer you on, but you'll have to do the, the heavy lifting yourself. Whoa, whoa! So it was like a, a three dimension to him. Line them up. And hey, did you catch that first message? It said something about a wave battle. Are we in some kind of splash zone? I guess we'll worry about that when we get to it. Let's just focus on these enemies for now, Mario. Speaking of, you're surrounded by four folded soldiers. Huh, where did the other three come from? If they all attack at once, you'll get a real pummeling. This looks rough. Hey, I just had a great idea. If you line all four of them up, you can jump your way down the row in one attack. Boop, bop, boop, bip, bam. So how do exactly do we do that? As you can see, one is missing. Lucky for us, these rings let us move the enemies around and group them together. So use L to select which ring you want to move, and then press A to confirm your choice. There's just one naughty Goomba out of place right now. Let's try and get it over to that empty circle. Okay, so I guess what I can do is I can select this ring, now use L again to rotate the ring. Once that Goomba is lined up with the others, press A to finish. So we can just, oh, and it's all timed too. I don't know if I like that very much. Okay, there we go. Great lineup, attack power up. Yeah, there we go, you lined up all four Goombas. When you group your enemies into a successful lineup like this, your attack power increases by 1.5 times. That means your attack power will go, be precisely, uh, oh gosh, I forgot how to multiply by a point. Um. Oh, whatever, you you get what I mean. Your attacks will do more damage. So keep lining up those enemies. All right then, so we have our boots and our hammer. Okay, now we can flatten these Goombas with a jump attack. Select your pair of boots using L, and then press A to begin your attack. See, we have boots right here. Standard boots, great for jumping on basic enemies. We also have the hammer, a classic. Mario's trusty hammer, great for hitting basic foes. So we'll, we'll do this right here, because this will only hurt the first two Goombas. Oh, and this does actually with like two like rows there. Interesting. We don't have any items. Okay, just wanted to sort of see that. To so start the battle, will there be timed jumps? Mario's turn. I think there is, okay. See, if we time the jump just right, we can actually do extra damage. Wow, these world, those world famous Mario jumps don't disappoint. You took out all four Goombas with a single jump attack. See what I mean? Lining up your enemies is totally worth the effort. Last wave. Oh, here we go, this is where we can use the hammer. Ah, more folded soldiers? I guess some battles are gonna have enemies attacking in waves. Oh, I guess that must be why this was called a wave battle up front. If you see last wave pop up, that must mean you're on the last group. Hang tough, Mario. These guys are lined up a little differently. So show me your hammer attack next. So as you can see with the hammer attack, well first off, we gotta move these guys, so first, I guess there's like two waves to each turn then. Your hammer will hit a shorter, wider area with one powerful blow. Those spaces marked with circle are showing you where your hammer attack will land. It'd be great if you could get all four folded soldiers onto those spaces. spaces. Let's give it a try, same as before. Select a ring using L, then press A to confirm. Okay, so we're gonna select this one, and just move it like that. A great lineup, attack power up, you did it! Now they're all in hammer and range. And they're lined up perfectly, so your attack power went up by 1.5 times. I'll uh, let you do that math. Okay, so you can see right here we have the, uh, well, time to swing that hammer of yours. Use L to select your hammer, then press A to start your attack. So yeah, we have that right here. we we'll gonna be doing it on all of the Shy Guys. And I'll try to time it this time, same deal. Oh yeah, so it's just like Color Splash with its timing. Did you see that? Blop! Ah, what a satisfying attack. Fast, flashy, and flattening, but only if you arrange your enemies into a successful lineup. Jump attacks and hammer attacks both have their own ideal lineups. Always think carefully about how your enemies are lined up before you attack, okay? Okay. Sounds good, so th there's a whole new battling system. Uh, I really like it, it seems interesting. We get a lot of coins, wow, 490 of them for one battle. That's crazy. So you defeated your, the first Goomba, bravo. I assure you, it is far from the deadliest creature in this realm. I suppose there's no point in maintaining this charade any longer. What is going on? You're not a shy guy at all, are you? What in the world are you? Brother! Oh! The plot thickens. Mostly because it was being folded. No, it can't be. I didn't want you to believe it could be you. 
How many times did I tell you to stop? Please, you have to stop now. Why wouldn't Mario have simply left you in that wall where I put you? Sister, if you stand in the way of my ambition, I'm afraid you will not share in my glory as a family. Oh, and by the way, I am no longer your brother, Ollie. I am King Ollie. Oh my. By the time I am done, all of those miserable toads will be folded. The flimsy paper minions of Bowser shall be reborn as loyal folded soldiers serving me. And I shall fold, crease, and bend the entire paper world to my whim, the birth of a new origami kingdom. That's not good. Whoa, what is he doing? Got paper streaming in from all over the place. He's wrapping up the castle. It's very pretty, but I don't think it's supposed to be good news. <laughs> Bowser's not happy. <laughs> it's a shy guy! Coming in for the save! I can't believe we're teaming up with Bowser! Let's get out of here! <laughs> oh my gosh! Thank you, Mr. Shy Guy! Whoa! Why is it in every Paper Mario game that the castle gets stolen? I guess not all of them, but but a concerning amount of them, people are always stealing the castle. Oh no, Luigi, I forgot about him. We gotta go save him. Oh no, this just keeps getting worse and worse. Where are we going? Castle's been stolen, Luigi's nowhere to be found, we just got split up from Bowser. And the Origami King might take over the entire world? Sounds like quite the to-do list for today, <laughs> to figure out all that. And we're falling. You okay, Mario? Oh, oh okay, I can make him wiggle out of here. <laughs> Come on, you can do it, yeah! Wow. So where are we now? So it looks like for right now, we have fallen into the Whispering Woods. What will this area have in store for us? I guess we'll have to find out in the next episode. I've already had a ton of fun with this game. It looks very promising. And yeah, I just can't wait to play through it. So stay tuned for some episodes coming super duper soon. But for right now, that is gonna wrap it up for today's episode of Paper Mario, the Origami King. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye bye.